drive. Cheers to our, uh, what, nine and a half hour drive. We only got six and a half left. I know, we've been making time. We're in Head River now. Mm-hmm. Having a little snack. Raspberries. Mm -hmm. Don't want, they're really good. Or like farm. Yeah. We're waiting for the truck. I don't know what's the hold up. Unless they want me to go Are first. they waiting for us? I don't know. It looks like they're, looks like they're um, cooking. Oh, one oh, sec. Oh, contact! <laughs> yeah, yeah, those are necessary. Yeah, that's important. I might be, I might be a tall guy in a city I might be, we might be Riding around on a Segway I can be a tall guy I can be a tall guy This is our second truck that we've seen derailed from the road Guys, we're going to bed. Race day one tomorrow. This is our room tour. Bed, closet, locked. locked. <laughs> you go Alpine's here. We're ready for inspection. There's a lot of pow pow, right, Mia? Yeah. So we just took two runs trying to manually groom and hopefully we won't have too many delays. Good afternoon, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Kiara. I'm from the University of Oregon. We're here watching some speedy skiers today. Yeah, Ooh. it's a hard one to stop there. One of those. <laughs> and she comes across with the time of, oh, it's so speedy, we have to scroll. <laughs> Maya comes across with the time of 51.92. On course now, we got one of our ducks from the University of Oregon. Sasha! Oh, yes! Oh, even a tuck! Wow, wow, we love that for you. Yep, yep, come to a stop. It's hard. <laughs> it's hard. Oh, Tina. Running out of order. Three, four. Oh, Tina. Yeah. Uh -oh. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Sorry about that. We're all in the timing booth right now running this. We all finished our runs. I had a really lovely crash at the end. I couldn't stop when I crossed the finish line, so I'm gonna insert the footage of it because my lovely aunt um, captured the moment and it was really dramatic looking, so. Good afternoon. My ponytail's a little messy, but we're about ready to start girl second run. I'm going 14th. So I'm gonna start stripping down. That sounds so bad if you don't understand ski racing, but basically, yeah, you get into your little spandex suit. It's a really good time. It's really great. Really speedy. Really speedy, really fun. Same course this time because there's just dumping snow. We can't even clear it fast enough, so. Fingers crossed this goes well, and I'll talk to you when I'm done. We're going to get the truck out. This time Iggy's stuck. Peggy's fine. Keep going a little bit. Now hold it there and try it. Is it just one tire spin? I don't know, I, I just arrived on the scene. Is it in four wheel drive? Yeah. Like low, like one wheel spinning? Yeah. That is not in four wheel drive low. Also, true start pushing? Oh yeah, this backing up method is working. Keep going. If you can't go one way, go the Perfect. other. Just now, she fell yesterday and finished just like I did. But that was a clean dismount because we slipped so well this morning. I finished! Run one done. It's really countering out here. We made it. 
just a snowstorm, a burning truck, a rainstorm, and five hours later, and we're no, no it's like ten. ten hours. No, but I five hours of me driving. Kiara drove like two thirds of the way. I think my mom stayed up just to make sure I made it home, going she, to bed night. She drove as soon as the sun set. Kiara hopped. Taylor hopped did take a large seat. portion of no, the drive. No, I did not. You did. I drove while it was still light out, and then I was like, okay, not my turn anymore. <laughs> All right, good night. Race one complete. This is also what happens. We have to unload our messy vehicle because we did a subpar job packing this, so this is what happens. Human beings are magical creatures. We can see what doesn't exist and choose to rise above what is. Unlike any other, Humans can feel without having to have actually felt. We can share each other's pain or joy. One might use such a power to destroy. Morning, Taylor. <laughs> you didn't pack last night. You packed this morning. No, I was doing homework last night. I know the same. I was determined to fi finish my physics homework. I was like, I'm not going to bed till this is done. And then I had to shower and pack. And then it was one. Cuántos gasolina te? Uh, uh oh, to have Tener. <laughs> Tienes. Did you say Panera? Yeah, right, this is way more fun. Annie's in the driver's seat. I have my radar detector to work on setting up. Lately I've been feeling something gonna change in a time to take a heaven. Don't gotta go that low. Keeping it, keeping it in control. This is our cute little house with a foosball table. Watch her get stuck in the garage. I'm nervous. You got it. Oh! That Utah spirit. Is there a time change here? Yeah, there is. I don't think the back end's gonna work. Come on, Peggy! Are we gonna say? That was better than the Incredicoaster, I'm not gonna lie. Can you start our trip off? Uh, where are we at? Yeah. Let's say Coeur d'Alene, even though we're close to that. Coeur d'Alene, Idaho Qualifier 2, action. Oh this is our house tour. We have a nice living space, very open environment, nice kitchen. Some snacks. Snacks? You already know they're oh my god, stars. wait, that's so nice. Taylor said there was a secret scary compartment. I tried and I was kinda got scared. <laughs> A rat, like ah! rat. <laughs> we find like ten thousand dollars. <laughs> Good morning from the lift. I'm here with my ducklings. <laughs> Say hi, everyone. <laughs> Let's do like a little run one course report. Anna, do you want to enlighten oh, us about how that was? So bad, bumpy the entire <laughs> way down. And we were going in the 20s, so <laughs> it was. And they're still rough. going, and number 77 is going right now. So <laughs> pray for them. Yeah, that was like one of the worst song runs ever. I skirted out of the course, but I skirted back in, so that was exciting. And I did finish, <laughs> barely. I only had enough energy to do a single skate across the finish line. It's a little pathetic, but... I don't even think I skated. Next run, the goal is to actually <laughs> ski from the front of my skis. I was literally just backseat riding, and gates were, like, hitting me, and people were pity cheering. So you have to fix that. <laughs> Yoga with you Alpine. Instructor Anna leading us to victory. Namaste. Smile. <laughs> so I did, I did, did my best to make you feel wanted. But what about what I want? What about what I want? And what I wanted was to crash with my dumb friends on the Good 
morning from UO Alpine. It's snowing and it's 8.30, so we're gonna load the lift and take a free run. Oh, they're almost done setting, but not the boys' course, so I feel like we have time for a free run. Welcome to the end of girls' second run. I haven't filmed all day, so here we are. Look our past. Little update, these two ladies hiked. Yeah, ladies. This man is in top 15. I thought you were saying top 15. 15. 15. Whoa. This lady's in top 10. Woo. Um, we're waiting for boys second run and still snowing here at this long course. Honestly, this course is not gonna course like two minutes. Oh we're having photo shoots oh right now. This is the wide angle. I'm sitting on my bindings right now. They do not feel nice. Help me. <laughs> <laughs> Mia is the official photographer of Hugo Alpine, and she has the nicest camera. Currently, we are rolling bee netting. I'm pulling from the top, and Taylor's talking on the phone from the bottom. Oh, Maggie's gonna help her. We have been assigned two rolls of bee netting, which we have chosen the top of the course. Of course, is already being taken down besides this gate. It's all a day. Oh my God, my hair is still like this. I think it's about to send it out. I don't know if I can pull it off. It's kind of more of an Anna thing. I just got home. Currently 1.38 in the morning. You can't really see that. But I took everything out of my ski bag. I'm exhausted. I drove from Spokane through Portland. Made it home safe and sound. It was a successful weekend. I am gonna go to bed now because I have a physics test tomorrow that I really desperately need to study for. So that's the plan. Um, I'll see you guys next week. We're going to White Pass and it's another week of Solemn. Shout out to my team for making this weekend so fun and all the people on other teams as well. It's just, it's always fun meeting people and running into people that you've raced with before. I just had a grand old time. Anyway, let's go to next week. Good morning from the truck. I'm starting this weekend's vlog off because it's pickup time. It's 9.45, we're kind of behind schedule today actually. We finally get to leave not at 6.30 a.m. Now we're loading all this stuff in the truck. We got Sammy Sue. We're going to White Pass this weekend. McKenna hooked us up with some Tinder merch. <laughs> Maggie looks the best. <laughs> like, no. <laughs> Guys, Meg matches the merch. Look at her hair. So now we're going to your bedroom. Don't you think we're moving too soon? I love to hear. and I are laughing at all this silence because it's like rough road, abrupt edge. Motorcycles use extreme caution. <laughs> and we're like, if you can put a sign there, like, why can't you fix the road? Taylor's doing great, by the way. We made it to the mountain. There it is. There's our run. Oh my god, there's a course. Someone's training. It's CI. Oh. There's their bus. Yeah, that's why they're so good. I keep losing to a moment. When I'm with you, I just can't focus. I love to hear your crazy theories. Look at our little home sweet home. One year later. Okay, Alicia and I captured our beautiful space in honor of Lucy. This is our family bed. So since Lucy can't be here, Alicia's taking the bed over. And then the other ladies are in their usual bedroom. <laughs> yeah, they get the big bed. And we got dinner for two days and it's gonna be $6 a person. That's why you shop as a team. Oh my God, it's already five. It's 4.50. We're cooking team dinner now, but Taylor has to leave, so I'm bringing her some M&Ms because she's literally hangry, I can tell, so I'm gonna bring them to her. I brought you dinner. Oh, you only want three? Or like, you can take more? Yeah. yeah. I, know, I said I brought you dinner. <laughs> take a handful. Do not understand. <laughs> this oven, I kid you not, is out of the 31st century. <laughs> It's so complicated. <laughs> if anyone knows what this also, means. Also, why does it say 1.6 and then? <laughs> and then six. And, and why do we have decimals? Okay, wait. I want to try. <laughs> and then arm? No, both arms. Both arms. You can use your I think legs, you just have to oh, get up and use your arms. Easy. <laughs> 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 Get in. Get in, everybody in. We're watching Don't End the Cats. Guys, it's so cold. Oh. I gotta love you all. Oh,
Good morning from White Pass. Look at all of our outfits. It's supposed to be pouring rain, and then midday hit 20 degrees and freeze. So. This is the current situation at the top of the course. Our tent just blew away, and we're all just hanging on. It's sleeting right now. So there's gonna be minimal filming before we're in this nice little barrier of protected trees. Update, the shelter has fallen apart. <laughs> there's a burial. That's gonna be all of us over and out. So. Guys, we finished our run. This has been such an adventurous day. Second run's over. We're exhausted. We're gonna go to the timing booth and announce for the boys. Ralph to Nick, who do you have in the gate? One. In a time. Kiara, I would like to know, can you hear me pretty well? Jacob, you're gonna hear my disappointment later when you watch this video. Um, what did I say about finish her? We're starting our team scavenger hunt. We're piled in, <laughs> waiting for something, to be, for something to be hidden. We're on team night. Meg and I are. I recruited her. I didn't recruit Alicia. <laughs> Tucker, Meg, Annie, and I. Team The Knights. Nice. Sponsored by Phil. Give us the countdown. Ready? Three, two, one. Go. <laughs> Come on, you got this, Annie. Get it, get it, get it. Search low, search low. Get low. You got one. Oh, upstairs. Upstairs. And add it, add it. Turn, turn, turn. Swipe right on. I don't have my phone. A matched. Match. <laughs> we got Kiara getting her, her race match. suit on, about to do five name? burpees. It has to go like. Is someone filming Key? Yeah, I'm filming myself. Meg is outfitting Tucker in the toga. We're looking good. Night family looks. Oh yeah, that's Rep really good. Rep I think we got. I think we got. Do you have okay, we can do this. <laughs> Our, our last task is to take out the trash silently. In, in, in. yesterday. This is seriously picture perfect. Wow. Hello. <laughs> Hello. We haven't been filming because we've been working. Anyway, we're gonna go second run. We're not inspecting, so full sense. We have the pattern down. Hairpin delay on the pitch. Hairpin that's sketchy that everyone's falling on. Hairpin flush hairpin. Let's go. It's been a day. Stressing out like crazy, just wanna be lazy with my girls. It's been a day, we gonna get wavy. All right, it's time to get our 16 Brian's bowls. Poor kid, now we go. Maybe we could go to the mall, get our nails done, get our hair done, we fly. Maybe we could holler at the boys. Look how many bags Tucker has. <laughs> Tucker the mule. <laughs> I look like a rough avocado. <laughs> Avocado. Yeah, because I'm wearing all black. We're gonna conclude this video here because we just had a little incident. Wasn't well, in our car. Almost had an incident. Jesus uh, took the wheel, though. But that's why we're listening to Jesus take the wheel because we were watching the truck back up and they came this close to hitting a car. Taylor did a little honking of the horn and here we are. We are one stop away from being home. That was the end of qualifier three. Good morning, guys. We're back. It's week four. Well, it's not really week four. It's qualifier four. We just had a two-week hiatus. I've been forerunning a bunch of high school races, which has been super fun. If I have any clips from that, I will insert them now. Just to show how we get down it's been a night we know how to party dancing like there's no one else around you know i'll be looking so fine i'll be like mine wearing these boots that high bitches in the corner with wine We so motherfucking fly it. We 
That has been absolutely a blast to still be able to get to ski during our weeks off, but it's finally qualifier floor. We're going to Mount Hood, which is my home mountain, and I'm really excited. I feel like we're traveling full circle because I ended my high school ski racing in Mount Hood, racing there Thursday nights, and today is Friday. We're leaving for the race. It's almost 12.30, so I have to get ready to go downstairs, but tonight we're actually training. We're night skiing. Coach Jason hooked it up for us, so I'm really excited to be able to go night skiing again because I haven't been in like four years. I have my overnight stuff carry-on stuff, the blanket, the jackets, boot bag, and then I need to get my skis out so I can get all ready to go. We're finally back doing GS races, so I'm hyped because honestly, love the Solemn, but was getting a little bit tired of the Solemn. We get to pull out these GS skis, take them for a spin. My parents are also coming this weekend, which is gonna be really fun. I'll see you guys on the road. I, I'm back, I'm on the deck. what's mine? I'm not broken, I'm still going, going up, 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 I'm not broken, I'm still going, oh no, You don't have to. You can just wait here. Oh, okay, fine. They're going down to the chalet. He was like, you can just meet us there. So yeah, if you, yeah, sorry. You should just turn around. Turn around. Just like these freaks. I just want to explain our story time of our near death experience. Okay, so story time. We go to get up this hill. We go to put it in four wheel drive to go get the gates that are at the top of this snowy hill because we're in the truck. I go to, right, with the instruction a la Tucker. And this is not the finest vehicle like truck my dad's is just a twisty thing you just go boom boom four-wheel drive what do you expect yeah this is a ford Not no tino that. shade we go to do that and we put it in a neutral pull the lever back thinking everything is fine and dandy and literally there's like a pop the truck ceases to work so i like am letting off the brake and we're just rolling backwards pressing the gas we're still rolling backwards i'm like okay emergency parking brake it was still not working we turned it on turned it off it was still struggling tucker hopped in and of course it just works perfect <laughs> no he got it to work after again so yeah, yeah no after we did yeah we messed around with it. it we got it to work again we got the gates in the back and now we're back headed up to meadows to go train but that was kind of fun adventure oh and then i embarrassingly followed jason to the chalet because i wasn't as aggressive to tell tucker don't follow them <laughs> sorry jason if you're watching this probably not but <laughs> <laughs> Like, if only we could do this every single week, how our lives would be changed. This is like hard stuff too, and I think that's good. Oh yeah, no, it's, it's a really challenge. Good. You need the challenge. Yeah, Annie! Woo! Get that area. Yeah, yeah. The last couple of people are gonna take the final run. I think that was my final run, because I don't want to- Come up, buddy, last run! Send it! And I don't want to get injured, so we're gonna pull the course, call it a day. So the snow is really, really firm right now, so we can't get any of our GS skates out. We got one drill, so. We're chilling out here, waiting to tear down. We just got to our condo. This is our room. So adorable. We've got a dream catcher on the wall. This place is so nice. We're making pizzas tonight. They're ready, so I'm gonna go eat. Training, twas a success. All right, Alicia, we're matching. Back. 
is a beautiful bluer day here at Mount Pitsky Bowl. Oh my god, when your edges are too sharp. Guys, look at this view. If this doesn't just make you smile. This is our run. This is like the easy part that you can tuck all the way down, which is super fun. And then up there we have waterfall. It basically goes over like three chunks, starting from really, really steep to mediocre to a sketchy waterfall, and then down this flat. All the little kiddos. <laughs> so cute. Megan and I are gate judging right now. We both finished first run, so we're happy about that. The course was really fun. And now we're just waiting for our next racer to come down. Mount Hood is back. We're here with Doug. He missed me run, but <laughs> maybe next time he won't. We're waiting for the boys race to start. We had four runner one crash. The boys are He's so ripping. good. He's ripping. That might be Look Spencer. That. Oh, that's Spencer. So Megan came in clutch and brought me a snack <laughs> while we gate judge. Thanks, Megan. <laughs> we're waiting for boys run too. It's getting kind of late though. We're also at the exact location where I flew, I came down here, do to do to do. This gate is literally straight onto this blue gate and I just went wee and apparently I made a sound effect that was really funny, but I saved it and we finished. So yeah, waiting for the boys to come down this waterfall pitch and then we will call it a day, you know, get some yumbles. I'm ending this vlog for day one of qualifier four, but we went hot tubbing after the mountain. Then we made yum bowls, which was wonderful. And then we binge watched cheer for like three hours. Today was such a fun day and it was so fun to see my parents and have them get to watch me one final time in my race. So yeah, kind of bittersweet, but I'll see you guys tomorrow. We're waking up, what time should we wake up? Like seven? That oh, seems so late, oh my God. I know, usually we have to wake up at like five or five thirty. No, this is like, we get to sleep in. We're like two minutes away from the mountain. 6.50, 7, 7.10. See you tomorrow. Like a drive in the sun, we know now the music We're gone. We got a little bit through the breeze. Ooh. In my head, baby, we be cruising. Oh, 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 oh. We're at the timing shack and we're doing announcing with Annika and Mia. So we're waiting for the boys. We just finished our first run. We're really grateful that we're in here because this is what it looks like outside. It's not the finest. Ron's out there like fixing the <laughs> fixing the finish line timing. Just ski racer thing. Yeah, that's the update. That's what we're up to. Just can't fight it. You know all the ways I like it. Yeah, get in this. Get in here. This is, guys, this is Sammy C's last race sad. ever. Sad. She's not going to regionals and I'm sad about it. How was it? It was super fun. She looks super speedy in her green helmet. I have this theory where if you wear a green helmet, you're faster. The first run was very sendy, and second run was not as much, but we still ended up top 20, so that was a fun, and my mom was like, oh, 2020 season, and top 20. Wow. I'm like, wow. Yeah, we put that together. Sammy, Sue, and I are kind of emo. It's kind of like sad to have the last qualifier say goodbye to like Ron and all the fun people. Gonna miss Ron. Gonna miss Ron, for sure. Yeah, we're just waiting for our team. Bye. Ice your shoulder. Good. Take care of it. Claire. Claire. She crashed over the waterfall. Oh. We're just waiting for our team to load up this vehicle. So yeah. we have a strategic way that we load or else it takes us like two hours to drop everyone off because everyone has to dig for their skis. We filmed like better <laughs> stuff last year, I feel like. I don't know. This will be interesting to edit because I have a lot of footage, but am I going to make it? Yeah. Oh, yeah. You'll totally, <laughs> you'll totally make it. So talk to you when the peoples come here. Yeah, those bindings have been through a lot with me. <laughs>